Hello and welcome to ASUS. We all know what a gaming monitor is and we all know what a TV is as well. But until this point, it feels like there's been a bit of a disparity between these two things. Gaming monitors certainly have performance on their side. You've got those fast refresh rates, those quick response times and gaming focused features as well. But TVs have the living room suitability and size on their side. That means if you do want to game on a larger display or just away from a desk, you're restricted to a slow and basic TV and you're giving up a lot of those advantages that a gaming monitor would offer you. That's why we've gone ahead and created this. This right here is the ROG Strix XG 438Q, a massive big format gaming monitor, perfect for both console and PC use. But what exactly is this doing to change the game? Let's find out. And I think I'm gonna have to adjust this shot because this is absolutely massive. Right, that's looking a bit better now. 4K and HDR combined are two features that you'll find quite commonly in TVs now. And that is exactly what you'll find here with HDR 600 certification, DisplayPort and HDMI, which is exactly double what you would normally find on a TV. Combine that with a four millisecond response time and already you can see that you're getting a much better level of performance than what you would normally find with a TV or a screen based product this size. To go alongside that is FreeSync 2 functionality, which is built into this monitor. That's a way of dynamically adjusting the monitor's refresh rate so that you get a really nice smooth gaming experience regardless of what your device is actually putting out. So that will work with both AMD based graphics cards and the Xbox One as well and it will work all the way down to a 48Hz refresh rate. So you've got quite a big range of areas where that can be really effective. And uh, we've focused on keeping the input lag to a minimum with that on. So you're gonna still get a really nice responsive gaming experience. And yes, that is FreeSync to HDR. So you don't have to turn HDR off to make use of this functionality. Everything can work simultaneously. So you really make sure that you're getting the maximum gaming experience. You don't have to make any sacrifices. It's definitely worth talking about the panel itself in this monitor. This 43 inch beast is a WLED panel, so it's really bright, looks really nice, and it's got this anti-glare coating on the front as well. So this is gonna look good, not just in your darkened bedroom, but environments with all kinds of lighting conditions. Of course, uh, like a living room, where maybe you can't control the amount of light that's coming in through windows or what other light sources you've got around you. Color space reproduction also comes in extremely good with 90% DCI-P3 or 125% sRGB, which gives you a massive potential of color space to work from. So regardless of what game you're playing, you're gonna get a really nice, rich, vibrant experience. Add to that, you've got features like shadow boost. So in those really, really dark areas, because there is some room to play with, you can boost those up a little bit and just make things a little bit more visible. So even those enemies that are lurking in the shadows, you can still see them perfectly perfectly clearly, where maybe on other displays, those blacks would just be totally washed out. You wouldn't really be able to get that definition. There are some more features that we've included in here to make this feel like a natural upgrade to a TV and not just a big gaming monitor. A lot of monitors these days don't actually come with speakers, but in here there's two Acer Sonic Master 10 watt speakers. So even without needing to hook up any external audio devices, you'll still get a nice decent sound reproduction out of the box. But if you do want to use an external device, there is a 3.5 mil jack on here too, so you can connect pretty much anything you like, whether that be external speakers or a headset. As is common with TVs, there's normally a remote control in the box, and this is no exception, because we've got one right here. As you might imagine, it's good for pretty much all your regular functions. You can turn things on and off, switch your inputs, change the volume, pretty much anything you need to do, you can do it from afar rather than having to reach around the back of the monitor. Although that said, we do still use our patented five-way joystick. So even if you are up close or if you happen to lose the remote, which Let's face it, it can happen sometimes, it might get stuck behind the back of the sofa. You can still reach around there and change whatever settings you need to super easily. And if you thought I was going to make one of these videos without mentioning Aura Sync, then you are sorely mistaken, because if you check the back of this monitor, there's a little LED projector that you can screw into the back, and that will project a nice little RGB light down onto your surface. So you can have that enabled or disabled, you can pretty much change whatever color or settings that you want, but it just sits there looking cool, and it adds a nice little bit of visual flavor to your setup. That uses its own little port on the back, but there are four USB 3 ports on here too. So there's a wealth of connectivity options. Regardless of what kind of device you want to hook up, you can pretty much run anything off this monitor, no problem. 